So the girls, let me tell you, the girls are going crazy for the skirt. So they do have some. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, at home with Nance is all about interior decor, beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and all things fancy. And if that's something you're interested in, please hit that subscribe button so y'all could chill with the most high gang and do not forget to hit that notification bell so you can get notified when i post new content in today's video we are gonna do our end of summer haul our end of summer sheen vacation haul and yeah so we are gonna start first of all with this piece right here so this is a silver sequin skirt. It has large and small sequins on it. So as you can see, it's a mini skirt. So this skirt I have seen in different places, like different brands have actually carried similar skirts. But uh, I decided to purchase this from Shein because it was really affordable. It was, I believe, eight to ten dollars, which I feel as do as a steal compared to other brands. And the skirt is well made. It is very lined on the inside, as you can see. And I mean, it's so beautiful. And if you saw my last chain haul, you would see that I did also purchase this skirt in green. So if you look at the last haul, you can see the green one and see how I paired it. So this one, I decided to pair it with a white shirt, you know, and the white blouse was also purchased from Shein. So I'm just gonna show it to you. Okay. So here's the blouse, it's right here. I'm gonna post a video so you see how I paired it. So I like this top, it's asymmetrical. So here is up and here is on the side. Like this sleeve is down on the side and this is up on your shoulders. And it's scrunchy too on the body, which I do like. I really do like scrunchy clothes because if you wear your undergarments like your girdle, your like waist trainer to like cinch your waist in, it does not show, which is why I do love undergarments, okay? And of course, in this outfit, I did wear my undergarment. I did wear my body shaper to snatch my waist in just a little bit. And yeah, and I paired it with the skirt. And that's the video. What do you think? Do you think it's cute? Do you like it? I actually paired it with my black Amina Mwadi um, sling bags. I actually wanted to pair this outfit with a uh, silver sling bag, but I just couldn't find a silver sling bag at the time I shot the video. But I think the black would do because the black has like a silver brooch on the top. So I figured the black would look nice. And then it's cute because it's not just all silver and white. So I feel like there's a little pop of color. The black gave it a little pop, you know, and I think it worked. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section, okay? All right, now let's talk about the next outfit. So the next one is this white bubble skirt right here. So the girls, let me tell you, the girls are going crazy for this skirt. So they do have some in Zara and some other um, um, stores. But of course, the Zara one we know would be like at least $50. So I decided to shit it, okay? Shit it, okay? So I went to Shane and I found some. And I found those ones and they are, um, what's it called? They are white. And I decided to buy these white ones. And it's kind of like a satin material, like a satin fabric, you know, but it doesn't feel cheap at all. And of course, it is also lined on the inside and it's stretchy, very stretchy. I believe I got like a medium or so, but look how stretchy it is. Really stretchy. So even if you got a small, if I did get a small, it will fit me too. I'm a medium actually, so I bought a medium. So yeah, so I decided to pair this with a vest. 
So the black vest, I paired it with. I did not buy from Shein. It's an old vest in my closet, and I decided to pair it with it. And I wore some white sandals, which I did not purchase from Shein, just some white sandals in my closet. And yeah, I believe it worked. And of course, I decided to jazz it up a little with some uh, black sunglasses. And here's the video. What do you think? I feel as though as it worked, the black and white. I just wanted that black and white look. And of course, I like this skirt too because you don't have to like, it's just very free. And you don't have to like not eat before you wear it because you know sometimes you're like, oh, I want my waist snatched. And then you don't really want to wear certain clothes because you're like, oh my God, if my belly starts look, looking big, it doesn't look as flattering, you know? So with this, it's very comfortable. I feel like I could eat, I could run. Of course, I did wear little shorts underneath because it is kind of short, short. So I wore little shorts just in case for some reason, my skirt does go up, I'm still covered. You know, you don't see like my, oops, you don't see like my butt, you know? So yeah. So that's why I wore the little shorts underneath. But this is really cute. I really do like it and I feel like it's a statement piece and it's just so carefree and so beautiful. And I did purchase this in another color. I purchased it in black. And I purchased the black because I just feel as though as I could do a lot with this. So with the black, which is right here, I styled the black two different ways. So initially, I put it as a top. Wore it as a top, like a little bubble top. And I wore it with like a skirt. I wore it with a black skirt. So the black skirt is not from Shein. It is from, um, I don't know where it's from, but it's an old black skirt in my closet. It's also like satin looking. So it does match the material. Like it does match the little satin fabric of the top. So it just really worked. So I paired those together and I feel as though as it gave it a crop top looking kind of look. Cause the top looked crop top when I wore it, you know? And then I wore the skirt and then I paired it with, uh, some black some Ford sandals. Oh my God. I feel like this looked really cute. Like this looked work for me, you know? And I feel like it's very stylish. It's like, you could go out, wear it out to brunch with your girlfriend. You could wear it out on date night. And I just feel like it works. It works really well. And as you can see on the video, I, um, wore the, the top, actually the skirt, but I wore the skirt as a top with the black satin skirt and then I wore it with the black sandals and I did pair it with like some um I also paired it with some bag you know the bag might not be in the video but it's on the thumbnail and the reason why I did not put the bag in the video because I was trying to just walk around so you can see how the skirt looks and everything but yeah so yeah this was actually one of my favorite outfits I really did not think this look would hit but it was hitting so 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 much surprisingly yeah so now the next outfit will be this number so this is a yellow dress it's so pretty but i did wear this dress backwards so i say that because this is the top you know like i feel like this is the top i'm not sure but it looked like this was supposed to be the top you know, right here like this, you know, but I decided to bring it like this. We had this in front and then took this side and wrapped it around my neck. You see in the video, but anyways, is a pleated yellow dress. It has little pleats on it and it is very lined, which I do like. I really like my clothes lined. You know, I don't want people to see my clothes, see my undergarments, see my underwear, you know, so I really do like my clothes lined and I wrapped this around my neck. So it was like, kind of like a scarf, you know, with the yellow, with the scarf around your neck. It looked really cute. It really worked, which was why I wore it backwards instead of forward. So I feel as though I could wear it forward and give, have the halter neck look. Or you could wear it the way I wore it. I just feel like this dress is very versatile. And you can see on the video, I just paired it with some simple black strappy shoes. And I also uh, styled it with my yellow um bag i do have like a little yellow rhinestone bag from alexander wang so i paired it together and i feel like the look was given it really did work it's so beautiful you know you could even you know wear it out on the bouch with your friends you could wear it out to parties i feel like this would go really good for a nice party let's say a friend's party a graduation party a birthday party you know it's just so beautiful it's very like night out and also day because of the color 
you know, you can wear it out on vacation. It'll look really good on vacation, you know, especially the yellow against your skin. So, yeah. So the next outfit is this. So this pink dress, I also decided to wear this as, um, you know, this, I just feel like I could wear it as, let's say, a vacation look. I could wear it as a birthday dress. It's so pretty. It's so sexy. I could wear it out as the main character. Like, it gives main character energy. So, if it was my birthday, I could wear this as a birthday dress, you know? Because it's just so beautiful. It's very sexy. It has the deep V-cut. It has, does have the ruffles. It does have the little flower in the middle. You know, it's just so pretty. It has the frills. It's everything. And, of course, it does have some little, uh, what's it called? Russian on the body, you know, so it is also lined as you could see and I'll put in the Video of the dress to see how it looks on me. So this I purchased in the medium and Yeah, it's a mini dress. It's short short. So if you're tall, you know, just wear a little short underneath So you don't get exposed, but I do like the color I paired this with some nude sandals like some nude mules I have but they are old they are not from Shein and I paired it with um, pastel pink bag and I feel like it does really work I really do like it and then um, I feel as though as I could also wear this on date night you know and of course this could be a very nice vacation dress I think I'll take this with me on my next vacation actually like I am definitely going to take this with me. I really do, really do like this dress. And look at the video. What do you think? Do you think I started well? Or I actually also thought about wearing this with a baby pink shoes because I do have like the pastel pink shoe. Um, but when I was shooting the video, I wanted something very easy. So which was why I grabbed the mules, the nude mules. And because it's nude, I feel like it will work with this color, you know? So, Yeah. And uh, the other outfit is this. So back to this skirt. So now this skirt I paired again with a top. So I, this time I decided to wear it as a skirt instead of as a top. So I wore it as a skirt and I do, did wear like a little Brazil jersey top with it which i got from shein and the jersey top looked so beautiful looked so cute i'm just gonna pop it right here because the jersey top is somewhere in my bedroom and i don't feel like getting up to go find it so i'm just gonna pop, pop it right here on the screen so the jersey top you know it comes down to like my waist but not quite you know just right above like let's say right below my belly button so i decided to type on the side just tied it into a knot. I tried to tie it into a knot on the back, but because it was just me tying it on the back, it was so hard for me to do it, so I decided to put it in front. And then I worked with some black sandals, I worked with this, and then I feel as though as I could also have worn it with like flats if I wanted to, or like sneakers if I wanted to, you know? I feel like it's very cute, very um, playful, and very chill. But then you can also dress it up with the heels if you want to. In this video, I decided to dress it up with heels. So, as you can see, you know, the heels are there. It does look cute. But if you are not right, like into heels, you can wear it with some flats, you know, and it will look really cute. Or you can wear it with some sneakers. Then, another look I was going for with this was to wear it in an oversized jersey. I have seen girls wearing it with oversized jersey and I really like that look. So I don't have the oversized jersey here, but they do have some in, on chain. So you could, I'm gonna look for some and pop it on the description box, okay? In case you wanna try it with that style. So with the oversized jersey, if I was wearing it with this, I'll probably wear it with like some socks and some sneakers, you know? Like some uh, dunks. Yeah. Yeah, I think that will look cute. Or yeah, or whatever sneakers you have. So, yeah, so let's go on to the next outfit. So, the next outfit is actually this top, which I am wearing right now. It's just a nice skims look-alike top. <laughs> so it's just, um, it's just a crew neck top, cutting top, you know, little sleeves. So I wear it with like my um, brown tights. 
you know so i do have some brown biker shorts i wore them together so i just feel as dress it's just a nice top you can wear out and about you could wear it as an airport look like you can see on the video i work with some slides and my little foot on bag you know i feel like it's a nice airport look it will go really good as a nice out and about look it will also go real good as an errand look you know and i just feel as dress it's very easy i could also wear this top with some jeans and just you know you know dress it up dress it down but i really do like the color it is brown it is very stretchy it's very breathable very light you know it's really light so yeah so um they do have different colors i also bought them in white i also bought them in black but i don't want to wear all each and every one of the color because you see one you see all right because it's the same thing so but i feel as though as i needed like a lot of tops like this for the summer even when i'm on like vacation i also Take tops like this with me just to wear out and about in the hotel or where to go eat breakfast. You know, you don't know you miss your breakfast when you go to like a nice resort. Okay, so now let's go to the next one. So the next one, I am just gonna pop a video of it on the screen. So that on the screen is just a black top, it's a black see-through top. It's actually a cover-up you know so but i'm wearing it as a top you know it's summertime you know and it's warm it's hot so i went with like a black bra underneath and i went with some jeans the jeans i did not get from Shein. the jeans i purchased from um i don't even know where i purchased it from because they're so old they're just jean shorts so i wore those and then i decided to also wear it with my black slippers i just wore it with my black old butcher slipper and then my like gucci bag you know so i feel like this will look nice as a out and about outfit run around outfit air you know you can't wear it to the airport because it's see-through i mean if you want to wear it to the airport and be uh, have it show your boobs you could do that why am i to stop you but me personally if i was wearing that i'll wear it out and about with my friends let's say for brunch you know date night well no not date night not date night just their jeans i don't wear jeans to, for date night so i wait for brunch where it's like let's say i want the resort if let's say i was on the resort on vacation and yeah you know it's really cute i really do like it but then the top i plan on wearing it also as a cover-up so imagine you wear it on as a cover-up with your nice bathing suit underneath with your bikini and then the top i feel like it'll look really 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 cute so these are all my end of summer vacation haul and i hope you did really enjoy the Shein haul let me know what you think in the comment section let me know your favorite pieces and yeah just let me know and i'll be catching you in the next video Mwah! don't forget to subscribe